Hey guys, Mark here from monsterbuckerteeth.com.au. In this short video, we're going to look at twin tiger teeth. Why? Because once you've got the lowdown on bucket teeth, you'll save more time, save more money, and get to the next job sooner. And what does that mean? That means more money in your pocket. And let's face it, it's better in your pocket than anybody else's, right? Right. Okay, let's get down to the nitty gritty of it all. So what does the Twin Tiger tooth do and where should you put it? The Twin Tiger is a double pointed tooth which is mostly used for penetrating compacted soil such as clay or if you're munching down on shell or, or some hard faced surface. So where do you put it? In most cases the Twin Tiger is put on the outer position of the bucket but if you really need to get into some nasty compacted material you can disperse them across the bucket face for extra penetrating power on impact. What about wear patterns? Well, in bucket teeth, tooth wear is hardly ever even, and the twin tiger is no different from other teeth. However, because generally they're on the edge of the bucket, the wear is even more uneven. Of course, a lot of this depends on how you're facing what you're penetrating. For example, if you're regularly loading from an angle, well, of course, you're going to get uneven tooth wear. Now, typically, the twin tiger bucket teeth don't have a tooth center line which means that they're not reversible, so you can't flip them over to get a longer life. However, what you can do is rotate the points to get a better wear balance. By doing this, not only will you extend wear life, you'll also speed up the productivity, which means more bang for your bucket, pardon the pun, more bang for your buck, and more money in your pocket. Here's a tip about rotating teeth regularly, and it's that most teeth these days are designed to self-sharpen as they penetrate ground. This means that if you don't swap them around evenly, you're going to do yourself out of a lot of money. And you can actually see on here where the arrow is, there's a beveled area on the tooth. That's the um, engineered uh, self-sharpening. So by more use, they get sharper, but of course, they eventually do, do run out of metal and time to get replaced. Anyway, well, that's about it for this video today. Uh, I hope we've uh, shed a little bit of light on your bucket tooth knowledge. And if you'd like to learn more on other types of bucket teeth, bookmark, bookmark this site. We're at www.monsterbucketteeth.com.au. Well, look, I hope to talk to you again real soon. Cheers. This is Mark from Monster Bucket Teeth signing out. Bye now.